A lot of people around here look forward to this time of year and all the outdoor concerts once the weather gets nice. But this year, well, I'm not sure where we're going to be allowed to go and do those types of concerts again. So one of Portland's best known voices decided to hold a socially distant one in her backyard. We're going to get through this. We will. It's important that we get through this. I know we will. Am I alive? Oh, is that me? My name is Storm Large and I'm a musician. Uh, I've lived in Portland 20 years and uh, I'm here promoting uh, my new nonprofit, Gimme Shelter PDX. Said he was a friend. And we're going to be granting performers of all disciplines in the state of Oregon up to $500 to help them pay for rent and their mortgages. Artists are you in the gig community are some of the most financially vulnerable. You know, we usually when you're starting out, you've got like three jobs that are usually in the service industry, and all that's done. I'm trying to get live. Come on, dudes. Here we go. It's great. It's the only fun we can have these days. It's perfect. We've got a little bit of an audience out here. I think it's fantastic. Absolutely. Yeah, it's filling a need that's really, really present. I'm here with James Beaton. <laughs> this is crazy. And I hope you guys are all doing really well. So we're just going to get started. I've got you under my skin. She's in the neighborhood. It's pretty cool. Got you under my skin. Well, at first I was I was having sort of hangouts and concerts in my house. And if you are anonymous, then I call them pajama sessions. From all of us, I love you. We're all in this together. Put on the camera and just play my ukulele, sing songs, check in with people, be like, how's everybody doing? I'm not famous, I'm not like J-Lo, but I have a fan base. Oh yeah! I'm not asking for money for these concerts, but if if you feel compelled because I put on a show for free to donate, I'm not gonna ask for money, um, but if you feel compelled to donate or to share the video and say, look at this that they're doing, um, this, is, this is for this fund, you know, then, then awesome. Yeah, we just walked down the street. <laughs> Pretty beautiful. None of us have ever seen anything like this before, ever. I'm scared too. Some of the best times, in a sense, of humanity because the best of us stood up for the weakest. Are you going to be that guy that stands up and says, how can I help? I see way more people standing up and saying, how can I help? <laughs> Mr. Rogers always said, find the helpers. And I'd love to be one of the helpers, if I can. If I can. There's a lot of us. Thank goodness. Right on, man. Yeah. yeah.